Hi, welcome to the ASP.NET Web Form and Entity Framework Learning by Jumbo Project. And today in this video, I would like to show you how to work with the home page. There are some information. Uh, it is a product and news on this page. So now here I will show you how to display the latest product and news on this page. There is the file record will be displayed here for the product and also new. Okay, so now let us start it. And I will open the sequence server. This one is sequence server and table here product. Yeah, so at this time we have one, two, three, four, five record of the product here. And the same thing for news. I will open this one. Yeah, we have three record. Okay. So now I will open back. I will open product here. News. Okay, so I will go ahead to add new. Mm, okay, so when we finish the coding, I will add news, uh, add more, more, more record to the news modules later. Okay. Back to the home, I will open the Visual Studio. Okay, so now scroll down. Default. Here you, you see on the screen I have the default page. Okay, I will remove something not necessary for this. We have the deep home product list. We contain some the 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 child deep inside. There are some information of the product on the top. We have we are hard coding it. Okay. It should be the same thing for now, so I will go, go ahead to remove something here. It did not need, because for now we are going to do it uh, dynamically, so no need to keep the static. Mm, yeah, this one is a section of the news. We will do it later, so now I will remove the product. Missing diff glow. Okay. And in the okay, so I will back to the first refresh this. And so for now we have only one one product here. And you can see after we remove the just some some necess some unnecessary uh, product in the static here, so the UI will be broken. I have to up update it a little bit to make it work. Okay, add new a deep here. Deep. Sorry. Class. We have a clear class. Okay, cool. <coughs> so now we can go ahead to write the code for latest new product on this page. However, as we as we all know in the previous video, we have we, we, we have worked with the user control. So now instead of writing the code in in this page default ASP file here. So we should write the code in the user control, and after that we will we will use it, uh, the wrap and drop it to you on this page. Okay, so now I go ahead to create a new one, and here we have five, let it five product here. 
So I will name it either user control e home. Okay, add new new item. Scroll down. You can see we have user control. We have from user control here. I will name it e let it five product. Okay. Okay. And I will go ahead to create let it five news. So we will work on it later. Okay, I will copy the HTML of the product into this file, cut it, cut it, so now drop and drop it here. Okay, so back to this one, because we have the search, remove the 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 deep of um, the deep of the product here. So now if you refresh this one, so nothing display right here. Okay, cool. Nothing for new product. Open it back. By open the latest five product. Okay, cool. On the top we have the registration session of the user control on the top. Okay. Save it and back to HTML. As uh, sorry, browser. Mm. We have to be with before we can run the website. Yeah, it back. Cool. So now I will write the code for this. Okay. So in order to display the the listing of product here, I will use the repeater to display the data. Lead data, I mean. Okay. I will use the repeater. I will name it the repeater let it product. Okay. I will open the back end code. Okay, and here we are working on the product, so I will open the product logic. We have a method to get the get product lead had been done in the previous video, so now we go ahead to reuse this one. Okay.
I will name it Prometod E5. Let it five products. Okay. Let it five products. Copy. Get product leads, okay. Mm. So now we are go ahead to get the related product, so we should be order by descending. The by descending those product ID. So now we only we only get five record of the latest. So we use the take five. Okay. Data by. Okay, so now I think we have done the backend code for the user control related file product. And now back to the HTML. Okay, so if now we keep it by default for now, and at this time we still keep the code of the static HTML here. So now if I try to build the solution and open the HTML. Uh, open the browser and try to refresh this one and what happened okay do not have a public property named div okay let me see repeater okay copy this one it should be inside an item detail template sorry for that view again yeah so you can see here for now we have five product had been displayed here uh okay i will, we open the product here because for now we have five product and if I go ahead to delete one in here I will delete the uh, this one and for now we have only four product and I back to this page and try to refresh here so you can see here for now we have only four product display here in here okay so meaning for now we are we are getting the uh, the right I mean the code is working fine for now and now I will back to the Visual Studio to make the data here e dynamically okay for displaying the image I will come on man this one I will use hyperlink Hi. Berlin. Okay. And for the product name, I will use hyperlink as well. Berlin. 
אוקיי. Okay. For the hyperlink, enter. For not server, I have a tune tip. Tune tip. Evil. Okay, back to the product logic and we open the product. Go to uh, definition. We have the product name. Okay, copy this product lead. Close this and default close this. Okay. The tune tip it should be display the product information. Okay. And we have another property either um, navigate na we get URL. Okay, so this one we will view the detail of the product. I will work on later. We focus on displaying the data for this one first. Okay, we have emis emit that's rc. Reason URL. Reason URL. Okay. I will convert. Convert to string. Evil. The emit it should be okay. Open. Emit, copy it. Evil emit. <laughs> okay, emit. and open this one and because okay product first product this one is a part of the image of our product and because for now we still don't have a module to upload the image for our product at this time so we are hard coding it okay we will use this part to load the image or add the thumbnail of image on the home page. Okay. Hyperlink. Okay, cool. Same thing for product title. Tune deep copy this. Same thing for this one.
Hi. Okay. It should be display the copy this. Price. Price. Okay. Good. So now let's try to build the project again. Refat. Yeah. So it seems the data is working fine here. And I will back to the image to see. Because for now we don't have the thumbnail of the of the product here. Okay. Image. Activation URL. Convert to GNF image. Okay, because we are using the user control, so we have to update the URL as a part of image a little bit here. Okay, so open the okay, no need product here. Start it here. So now it should be. Um, Okay. Okay, cool. And now I go go ahead to add a new iPhone seven. Alert. Red. Okay, alert. Emit. Yeah, iPhone 7 blurred. Okay, so you can see here, Parai, we don't have the format for the number. It is greater than $1,000. So we have to do the format for this. Okay, this one, Parai here. People. Okay, good. It works fine for now. Open back this one. I will remove some comment out code here. No need it anymore. 
okay so now here open this one and at this time we have five product here okay so now if i'm go ahead to add a more new a new product new one iphone 7 plus 100 and Yeah, so for now we have six product, but we still need to play only one. I uh, sorry, only five product here. There are, there are the five listed. Okay, so now I go ahead to edit some the image here because at, at this time we have only one image. I will make it look better for now. Open this one. picture. Okay, here I, I have some the image download from the internet. I will copy it to, it to project. Copy. Open this one. Emit product. Pet. Okay. Okay, I will re replace iPhone 8, iPhone 8, iPhone 8, okay, replace this one, only name, iPhone 8. iPhone 7 Okay Okay, look better iPhone 7 Okay, good. So now when you hover on the on on the image and also the the the, the product title here. So actually, when you click on this one, it it should display the product detail. So now I will guide you how to do it. Okay. Open Sequence Server. And here we have the hyperlink. There are the property name it is navigate URL here. So it will help you to navigate you into the detail page. Okay. So now here, when you open the product management here, when you click on the product name, it will direct you to the detail page. So now here I will direct you to this page. Okay, product. Now we get URL. It should be evil. 
Por ahora, ID. ID. And the path you want to be navigated to. It should be product dot a at p h question mark e i d equal zero. Okay. Refresh this one. And when you hover here, you can see at the uh, left corner here, bottom. There are the detail page. Yes, it will direct you to the detail page here. Cool. We do the same thing for the title. Okay, so now we have just finished to loading the data for latest file record of product. And now we go ahead to work on the latest file record of news. Okay. We do the same thing as we did for the product. Open this one. And I will open the... Okay, here I will open the default path, default user control E, let it find news. Okay, copy the HTML here, news party. Okay. Career demand, let it new. Delete something here. I try to refresh this one. Yeah, so nothing display for the news. Back to this one and view it again and reuse the user control. Let it find news. Yes, head with bike. Okay. Back to news. New, new. Okay, I will copy the image here.
Okay. I will copy the code of the five product. Copy this. Comment. Here in the image we don't have price, so I will remove this one. Price. Okay. We have a new logic. Get new list. Okay. New logic. Okay, cool. Close this. Close, close. And this one should go to the news. News. Okay. To definition, oh, sorry, definition news new title, new title. Okay, build the solution, open the browser and refresh this one again. Yeah, so you can see here for now we have three, three records of news. So now we are displaying three records here. When you hover to the image and also the, the title here. It it display in the, the 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 URL of the detail detail page. You click on this one to view detail. Okay. Cool. Cool. So now I will go ahead to add new some data here. Uh. 
new no for that new no fine. Here, update the image. Open product, product. Mm, copy this one. Image. Oh, sorry, news. No number. Okay, but this is one. Okay, let me see the. Image of news. Oh, only fifty character for the product. Let's see how many. Okay, one hundred and fifty. So we should increase the the length of the image for news. Okay, cool. Okay. So I think that's all for today. And after you finish this video, you know how to work with the home page to display the latest new of the product and news on this page. And you also know how to do some formatting for price for the for the product listing. And also you know how to view the detail of the product when user hover and click on the the, the the image thumbnail to view the detail for product and news okay so i hope that video will have food for you and do let me know if you see any issue bye bye and talk to you later